In this tragic image, a group of African penguins stands on a rocky shoreline, their feathers stained with dark patches of oil. Their once sleek, waterproof plumage is now heavy and matted. Some bow their heads as if exhausted, while others attempt to preen, unable to clean themselves. These birds have been caught in the aftermath of an oil spill, an invisible threat drifting silently across the surface of the sea. When oil coats a penguin's feathers, it destroys the natural insulation that protects them from the cold ocean. Water seeps through the damaged plumage, lowering body temperature and leaving the bird vulnerable to hypothermia. As the penguin tries to clean itself, it often ingests the toxic oil which harms its internal organs and reduces its ability to hunt. Entire colonies can be affected when a spill occurs near breeding sites or feeding routes. The industries associated with oil spills include offshore drilling, shipping, marine transport, and fuel distribution. In regions where African penguins live, the waters around South Africa are busy marine highways for large vessels. Tankers, cargo ships, and fuel transportation companies regularly travel these routes. Several international shipping lines operate along this coast, along with oil companies that extract and process crude oil offshore. While accidents are rare compared to the number of ships that pass each year, a single spill can have devastating consequences for wildlife. Scientific studies show that African penguin populations have declined sharply over the past century. Oil spills are one of the major threats these birds face, along with overfishing and habitat loss. Conservation organizations in South Africa have carried out remarkable rescue operations, cleaning thousands of oiled penguins by hand. Research confirms that rapid intervention increases survival rates dramatically, yet prevention remains the most effective protection. These penguins, standing together in their stained coats, remind us of the fragile relationship between ocean wildlife and the industries that share their waters. Their survival depends on our willingness to safeguard the seas they call home.